is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Good morning, everybody. This is the, uh, what is it, Wednesday, the last day of January, 31st of January, Tiger Financial News Network, a market update at 10 a.m. Basil Chapman here, Dow's up 13 at 38,479, made a new high of 38,588. This is still a leg A in the weekly chart. My suspicion is next week we see a peak A because we don't go above, uh, very much anyway, above the 38,588 level. We're looking at the S&P already giving back some. S&P right now is down 32 at 4892 made a high yesterday and that was an all-time high with the tiniest little doji candle uh there's a little room maybe for a little bounce uh, but i think we are in the process of having some kind of a digestive phase look at the qqq that's trading right now the index 100 a vehicle is trading down five at 420.35 uh we were looking at the iwm trying to hold better it is holding uh, down 60 cents at 197.07. Not great, but it's not, it's not breaking down. Gold has had a very sharp move up, anticipating something from the Fed today. It's up 20 at 20.71. So you can see this little swoop to the upside says that there's a chance that it could test the upside uh, resistance, which is between, let me just give it to you right now, the high of the 16th of January and the continuous contract of 20.81. And then the next one is 20. 80, uh, 2086 from the, uh, what date was that? From the 12th. Now we're looking at the dollar pulling back. Dollar's pulling back, just 22 ticks from the 200 period moving average. It's pretty much almost hit it or hit it for the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight days, at least seven out of the eight days. Oh, it did go to, I think it went, yeah. So this is the 200 period moving average of 103.71.73. The further it pulls away downside from that, the less it becomes a magnet. Looking, talking about a magnet, look at this. Bonds went right over the 200 period exponential moving average. They're up 1 uh, and 12 30 seconds. That's at 122 and 20. Let's see what happens after the Fed speak today. This is good action. Let's go to crude oil, and crude oil is uh, down $1.20 at 7662 off the peak D in the daily chart. Basil Chapman, Tiger Finish this hour. Got a lot to discuss. Be back in a few moments. Check out my opening call, Daily Newsletter. See you in the